Hey everybody and welcome back to Unholy Heights and in today's episode I hope to actually make some more progress. I've been working on my creatures a bit more since the last time I left you. And we actually found a new monster along the way. Um, who are these guys? Like slug guys with houses instead of shells. My home, which is really Really awkward creatures, and I'm starting to hate them a little bit, just because they've been stiffing me so much in terms of rent. It's been like a constant battle with so many of these guys. But on the bright side, many of their feelings are like, at least pleased or ecstatic. These guys, really hard to please, and oops. But yeah, I've done all I could for the most part. <laughs> I've put in a lot of time, more time than I'm really comfortable putting in, but... You know, I, I did power them up quite a bit. Now let's just look what is going on here. What is that? I, they actually gave me easier missions? Really? Dirty bombs, dirt cheap. Wow, I did not even know about that. That must have crept up on me as I was uh, doing the grind. The fact that there are three starred uh, quests is really refreshing since well, I was kind of a bitch getting these guys to the point that they're at. I mean, I have finally at least a Bony Musha at 80 power. Not the greatest, but it's a hell of a lot better from the 40 that it used to be. These guys, they're actually mid ranged uh, creatures, so they have 81. Well, that's due to breeding, but yeah, 81, and it's a mid-ranged uh, creature, so that's pretty damn awesome. I'm going to have to change them around a little bit to uh, take advantage of the, just due to the nature of its uh, attack type. For the most part, uh, it looks like we're actually going to make some kind of progress, get some new monsters. I was not expecting that. So armed stealer caravan apparent uh appearing or whatever. Got a monk, so our ghost should be able to take care of this. They're pretty good at that. Well, if you don't run away at least, that's um, also important. Also we also have this chick that actually uh found a boyfriend or girlfriend, whatever. They can't take damage for shit, so uh yeah. Run your behind out of there. Whew, that was close. But, that was a pretty easy mission. Easy 2000 gold. And we got a uh, helmet teepee. Helmet teepee. Wow. Uh, what's a helmet teepee? My god, I had to I had to bring down the volume on this thing just because that noise is driving me to the brink of insanity, just to say the least. I mean that sound is really annoying. And when you have it fast forward like this, it happens a lot. It happens a hell of a lot. Let's see, um these guys have really expensive tastes too, that's what I'm also discovering here. A home theater. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's not happening. PC tower, at least that's a bit more... It's a little easier to do. I can spend that much money, but... I mean, 8,000, that's... That's steep. That is really steep. And if you want a punching bag, for some reason, you want a punching bag, you're a ghost. But, you know what? Could be worse, could be a $8,000 home entertainment system you want. And that's not gonna happen. This lady, this lady, she wants a large bookshelf. Could use a desk, so I'll get you that. Um, a large bookshelf, though, that is expensive. 5000 for a bookshelf. I'm sorry, you're gonna have to wait a little bit. 
these guys are they're all right. They tend to be they tend to skimp out on the rent a lot. Actually, a whole lot of the time. These guys they're really hard to please. I don't think there's going to be ever a time when I can please them. So gotta do what I can do at least. Let's do this too. Four star mission. New monsters. I like that. Cause God knows there still are um, some creatures out there we haven't gotten yet. So gotta make things a little interesting here. Cause I I would like to get rid of these guys. I'm not in too deep with them in terms of breeding. They're kind of they're weaklings. So I won't miss them. So you know. Alright, so physical attackers, so we can use some ghosts. Except, that could be really bad though. Really bad, actually. Which can really mess us up. But really good against the pirate though. And I don't know why you're running. Why are you running? Okay, no one died. That's good. And we got a new monster, right? Oh, okay, it's three rounds. Oops. It's alright, though. That one was really easy, and... I mean... Since doing this whole breeding thing, we have been getting some slightly more powerful monsters here. Making a good chunk of change, but... Then again, when I was working on these guys, um... I've always run into a lot of issues where people were just not paying their rent. It was getting really ridiculous. So I would really like raise the rent on these guys, but you, I don't know why you're the way you are. Let's raise this a little bit. You, you're a middle manager. You can afford this. I don't want to hear nothing from you. Capiche? This guy, he's, he's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. He doesn't give me much problems, so I respect that. More powerful zombie than his parents, that's for damn sure. Poor Kra, he's been single for the longest time. Damn, he he pays his rent. He has never skimped out. I'm just waiting for like one of these children to uh, grow up so I can actually kick their parents out. That's like the name of the game, really. You wanna pump these guys up a little bit. Good in, good eating. Uh, that's gonna be easy. It'll be easy, trust me. Gonna use my fork against you, I guess. Well, not like that. Nope, oh, run. Try and use the ghost for this. Ghosts will be more effective here. You guys can't do shit against them, so. You see? Just mop the floor with them. And my pig is going to pretty much stab her with the fork, huh? That's a pretty painful way to go. And just one more round and uh, we get a new creature. Kind of looking forward to it. I know there's like that spirit with the flaming head that we haven't gotten yet. What is this? You're a pro wrestler, you're kind of weak though. Attack wise. That's just a freaky looking thing. Did not look like a cheap, that's for sure. Huh. It's pretty interesting. These guys, ugh, they're not going to be of any help, really, if they keep doing this. On jacuzzi, I don't see what a ghost would need with a jacuzzi, but you're going to have to pay for it. Child was born. Yeah, these ghosts, they, they're like rabbits in this game. I swear to God, they reproduce just like rabbits. If there's any one type of creature, they're gonna have children. Always. 
Oh, and Jersey Ashore, that is just... That's something I did not need to hear, I hate that show. Oh. Really? That's it? No, seriously though, wow, that's... It's a lot, but still... I'll just wipe the floor with them. Have you seen my army lately? I mean, these guys, they don't mess around nowadays. They're pretty pumped up, so... We'll have to keep a close eye on these guys now. That sucks. Yeah, run, don't kill them. I invested a lot, actually. Kind of. Yeah, either way, they're dead, so... Ha! Jersey Ashore was destroyed. You got 5,500 gold and a new creature. The ceilings? I gotta see this. And new missions available. Good news bears. Uh, oh, we're just getting all the missions for like the new creatures. I guess I must have triggered something when I was uh, raising my monsters a bit. Interesting. Oh, I guess if you get your creatures up to a certain amount, then more things start opening up to you. I don't know. It's all news to me, but I'm, you know, I'm more than happy to do that because these missions, they're going to kill me. They are really going to test me. And if, it, if I have to raise a new batch of tenants, I will be... I'll be kind of mad, because getting these guys up to what they are right now, that was kind of... This is like the equivalent of level grinding in Final Fantasy or any RPG that requires it. And if you've played RPGs a lot, if you did a lot of level grinding for like hours upon... Well, a good hour or so, and then you lose that progress, it's, it's demoralizing and you just feel like tossing the controller and saying screw it. Oh, these guys, we haven't seen them in a while. Office clerk. Eh, too bad I wasn't crazy about them, though. Not a bad monster, I just... I used them in the wrong way before. And Fampu got a lover. That is great. Yeah, I think I killed off your girlfriend before. Now that I think about it. Yeah, he's got a lot of work to do. Only 48, I believe it was. Wait, new monster ceilings. That's not a good impression. You're unemployed. <laughs> Your chances were quite low for that. Thanks for the interest, though, but really. No. One thing I will have to do in the future is move these two, because... Since they're mid-range, it doesn't make sense for them to be here. That's for darn sure. These guys are so interesting. Zor Jr. <laughs> Looks like a cat. Is that a cat? Yeah, it is a... It's got... It looks like a cat, but... I can't be certain on that. And then we got the chick. It's like the ultimate form, final evolution of the chick, I suppose. Let's do it. Uh, let's save up and then we'll get the third new monster for this episode, actually. I mean, who would have known more progress being made? Because the last couple of sessions have been kind of lackluster in terms of progress. Nothing really of note to, like, report on. Unlike this, uh, this set here, I mean, damn, it's not even 15 minutes yet, and... We got two new monsters. So I will have to consider who to kick out here. I mean, if I kick them out because they're just so hard to please, it's ridiculous. Alright, we got three, got three uh, rounds of this stuff going on here. Easy, easy, easy. Kunoichi. We're gonna have to isolate her though. Otherwise, it can be kind of troublesome. And you know what we're going to, well, no, we have to use the surprise factor here. There we go. And run. We can't lose these guys, so it's like, 
I have to be even more attentive with uh, each creature who goes off into battle. Especially him. At 80 power, if I lose him, that is a pretty serious loss. 